What is up, Jamly? This is JamiroFan2000 with yet another episode of the Jamiroquai Men and all the latest Jamiroquai news in less than one minute. And today's episode will be a little bit extended to cover all the latest odds and ends of news that I could find over the last few days. So let's get right into it. First off, uh, the Jamiropedia page, which I, which I have talked about in the past, is a collector site, a Jamiroquai collector site, listing all the latest media and uh, TV appearances by Jamiroquai, JK, anything affiliated with Jamiroquai. Well, the site went through a little bit of an update, giving up uh, some more information about recent appearances by JK on Top Gear, uh, JK's appearance on uh, Japanese television earlier this year, and other uh, assorted uh, appearances by the band. So be sure to stop by the Jamiropedia website and check out all the latest updates on that. Uh, JK did record a special promotional video for the upcoming Casino de Paris gig, which is a con which is a French resident-only contest, which I previously reported about. Um, basically, just doing a promo video about the concert coming up on May 14th that's going to be emanating from Paris, France, which uh, t whose tickets are only accessible by contests from Virgin Radio France and a banking uh, a banking company within the, the country of France. Um, also, in kind of interesting, cool news, uh, Stuart Zender and a guy named Skate Cowboy, um, Skate Cowboy, if you're not familiar with Skate Cowboy, he was a, he's an affiliate of uh, Stuart Zender's who has been working on the Zender Music website and affiliated YouTube um, channel. Um, in the past, they had been putting up uh, some of uh, Stuart Zender's private collection of demos from back in the day um, of his demo tapes from Jamiroquai's early days of recording. Um, their previous uh, uploads were uh, session demos for Morning Glory and uh, a few other assorted songs. Well, apparently, um, according to a post from Skate Cowboy on the Jamiroquai International Fan Forums, there has been a mini disc found of early Jamiroquai recordings by Stuart. Uh, the digital transfer of these uh, of the said material is yet to be pending, so I just thought I'd pass that all along um, about that being found. Uh, and also, um, let's do a little bit of a channel update here. Um, the channel has been doing really, really well. I've been really, really happy with everything going on there. Um, I'm happy everyone's been enjoying the uh, rarest Jamiroquai re or rarely heard Jamiroquai remixes uh, playlist. That's going to be taking a little bit of a hiatus. I Shut up to put up the last episode of that, which is episode 12 about the Planetary Club mix of Emergency on Planet Earth. So be sure to check that out here on the channel. And also, uh, the my top tw 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 top 20 Jamiroquai countdown is still trucking along. I should be putting up episode set or should my 17th pick uh, later today onto the channel. And uh, yeah, I mean, I might be. Um, I'm going to possibly be throwing up another uh, new series called Bands Like Jamiroquai, which is a series that originally emanated from the Jamiroquai subreddit, where various users or visitors to the subreddit could post up artists that are very similar to Jamiroquai. So I figured I'd go ahead and do a video series about that, basically highlighting some of the artists that sound very much like Jamiroquai and really, really worth a check out uh, in between listings of Jamiroquai. So I hope that series might be as, as well received as the, the top my Jamiroquai top 20 countdown. Uh, let's see if there's any other news that I can report to you. Um, in regards to the current uh, the current limbo that is the Jamiroquai U.S. release of, of Automaton here in the United States, um, <laughs> I, your guess is good as mine. Um, I have repeatedly tweeted the Jamiroquai HQ Twitter account about a revised release date for Automaton here in the United States, but um, I'm starting to think that this album is probably going to be on a import only for right now, only because uh, there's some... The demand was over the supply when this album was originally released back in April. So, yeah, I, I, I can understand they're playing a little bit of catch-up right now on actually having physical copies of these albums. So, uh, I'm still going to say May and June for right now until I actually hear otherwise from either the band or the record label. So, just hang in there. Um, and if any American Jamiroquai fans want to get Automaton, order it on import. You can go to Amazon. You can go to the Jamiroquai store. Try those uh, Try those outlets to see if you're able to order it. Thank you. Also coming coming to my channel potentially will be two potential unboxing videos. One of the Record Store Day Automaton 10-inch vinyl, which I'm still waiting for to arrive for me from England, and I will be doing an unboxing of the Double Gatefold Automaton vinyl release album release. So keep an eye out for that coming up, and probably in the next week or two once they can arrive to me and I can have the time to record videos. I am currently on vacation, if you don't know. Um, I recorded this before I went on vacation, but I'm going to be going on vacation during the weekend of uh, Secret to My Own. So uh, I, will, I will be trying to put out some more videos probably early next week, 
but uh, I'm just taking a little time off to rest and to relax and enjoy a little bit of the spring weather. So um, yeah, that's about it for right now. Oh, also, one more note, uh, a fan by the name of Javis from the um, Jumeric Y, or sorry, Jumeric Talk International Fan Forums, did an absolutely amazing bootleg of the recent uh, La Salle Playlay Jumeric Y Automaton Tour concert date. He basically, put together all audio snippets of all the, based off Periscope, based off YouTube recordings from the gig and made a bootleg out of it. And that is currently available up on the Jumeric Y subreddit. So be sure. Everything discussed in this Jumeric Y Minute, uh, of course, is all, as always, uh, all the links to everything that I discussed is, of course, in the description of this video down below. So be sure to check all of that out. And, uh, yeah, every, uh, as before mentioned, uh, everything, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm happy the channel is still doing really, really well right now. I'm glad that everybody's having a great spring and, you know, hopefully coming up on May 14th, I will be doing coverage of the May 14th concert from Paris, France. Not from it, but uh, I will be covering it here on the channel, so expect a playlist, maybe band videos and whatever. I'll do a whole video talking about everything that happened at that gig, and of course the two upcoming gigs in Asia from Seoul and of course from Japan coming up uh, in late May, so be sure to watch the channel for a coverage of those two concerts too, of course, as always, fan pictures, of fan videos, and bootlegs, what have you, everything will ho hopefully be covered, I will hopefully cover all of that in those videos around the right time. So that's it for right now, this is Fan 2000 I hope I have a good vacation. <laughs> And I will see you again really soon, very soon, with more Jumeric Wine Minutes, more Jumeric Fan Talks about and of course, keep your eyes on the Jumeric, the top, Jumeric Wine Top 20 Countdown. There are going to be some surprise picks coming up, so buckle in, everybody. This is Jumeric Fan 2000. I'll see you again really soon. Bye, everybody, and have a great weekend.